So look to see you on the runway. You know what I'm saying? Anytime we're raising awareness and money or whatever the case may be for our good cause, you know what I'm saying? I can't help but you know bump bump my shoulders a little bit. But right now we are still keep we are still cooling things down the runway with the um, Walk With Me Laura Foundation Cool Down the Runway series. Right now benefiting the St. Jude's Children's Hospital. And I have a representative from St. Jude's Children's Hospital, Miss Tina. Now now trust me y'all, the girl is VIP. Miss Tina, what's going on? <laughs> Nothing much. I am so honored to be here today. It is such a blessing to be here and to witness this and to see the kids involved. It's great. It's really great. Yeah. It's great. Okay, now you definitely gotta let us know. Now, now cool down the runway. You know what I'm saying? They've been doing this thing for a while, but this time St. Jude's is attached to it. How'd that come about? Yeah. So um, I have an organization that I started, which is the Light and Salt organization. And we've been working with um, St. Jude for three years now. So we have a unique opportunity where we've um, been allowed to partner with them. And in our partnership, we're raising awareness to the faith-based community about St. Jude's programs that they have for the churches to give back. And Vanessa and I, um, who is the founder of Walk With Me Lord Foundation, hi Vanessa. Um, we, are, we are good friends and we um, sat down and we talked about this and we were like, you know, she really wanted St. Jude to be a beneficiary this year. So we made it happen. So we're excited. Yeah. I'm really glad you did because I get to meet you. That's really good. Okay, now, children overcoming obstacles. Now, people hear that, you know, people think, oh, but let me even know how serious this really is. It's serious. It really is. And it's so important that we get involved. Um, to those of you who do not know, 
um, St. Jude Children's Research Hospital, every child that receives care never receives a bill and they're dealing with catastrophic childhood diseases. And the thing that I love about St. Jude is that not only do they take care of the kids, but they take care of the parents as well. The parents, all of their transportation, their um, housing, their care, everything is taken care of free of charge. Now there ain't nothing in life that's free. It's so right. Nothing in life is free for real. But listen, <laughs> <laughs> but we got a responsibility to make our air clean and good but anyway St. Jude is doing an incredible job and they're dealing with children and Vanessa is incredible she's just been so great in everything that she's done with helping children with catastrophic diseases so we all need to get involved our children are our future That's true. they are our future so we must get involved that is true now um children are the future now whenever whenever you think of a fashion show connected to this how does that help build this thing for the children well, I think it's wonderful. One of our, our, our goals this year is creating a generation of future givers, and we want our children to be able to give back so that they can pull from this 10 years from now, 20 years from now, and say that it's all about helping somebody. So that's what it's about. It is. Now let everybody know how they can get involved with you, St. Jude's, and, and the whole foundation. Yeah, 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 absolutely. You can go to Light and Salt NJ. Um, that's on all of our social media from Twitter to Facebook, um, St. Jude. Um, St. Jude Re Re St. Jude Children's Research Hospital dot o o dot org. You can get in, get that, and then we also have, of course, the Walk with Me Laura Foundation. Yes. yes. All right, sounds good, everybody. I'm your guy Z Fly. We are here at the cool, cool down the runway at the Essex County College. Keep it locked. So much more to come. I'm glad you came. Right, we're still rocking it out here at Essex County College. <laughs> we're in Austin, cooling down the runway, benefiting. St. Jude's Children's Hospital. Now, you know, since we are here benefiting St. Jude's Children's Hospital, let's learn more about them. On the side of me, I have one of the highly respected representatives from the um, foundation, Terrence, on the side of me, correct? Yes, yes. <laughs> All right, now, Terrence, now, we're here, you know what I'm saying, we're doing a great fashion show, a great event, raising money, but tell us about St. Jude's and, you know, what we're actually raising money for and who? So, St. Jude Children's Research Hospital is really leading the way that the world understands, treats, and defeats childhood cancer. Um, that, and it goes um, beyond that. For people of color, um, it also means uh, the best sickle cell treatment in the world and a, a lot of other catastrophic diseases. So, um, and our families never pay a bill. So your donations are making sure that uh, treatment, housing, food, is travel is all taken care of. So the families never receive a bill. That's really good. Now as you know, this is um, children overcoming obstacles. Why do you think that, I guess, certain like cancers is, is affecting children so much these days? I think there's a, a lot of different reasons why just for mankind and um, children that different things from environmental to genetic things. And so that's a lot of what research is happening there. So it's very important that we're able to do the research upstairs, send the treatment downstairs, and then try it as soon as possible okay. to make those discoveries and figure out why and how can we prevent it. Sounds really good. Now, what is your position um, at St. Jude's? Awesome. So well, you smiling about that. <laughs> yeah. Awesome. Um, I am the Senior Regional Development Representative for the New York and New Jersey office. Okay. So, um, do a lot of fundraisers. Now, how how important is fundraising? You know, a lot of people think, you know, it's, a, it's, it's something to do to come out, get the community involved, but I believe it bypassed that. How really important is a fundraiser to the community and people? For St. Jude, it's number one. It's the only reason why we can do the great work that we do. Um, it costs uh, approximately $2.5 million a day to run the hospital, and that is done by people. So 75% of those funds come directly from donors, wow. from you, me, our parents, our grandparents, who saw the vision of Danny Thomas, the founder, and said, I want to give $5, I want to give $1, I want to give $2,000, I want to give a million dollars, so that childhood cancer is vanished. So that we, in our lifetime, we can defeat it. Exactly. That sounds really good. Now, the Walk With Me Laura Foundation, I know Vanessa, she's definitely all about this. How is it working and coming together with Vanessa? It's beautiful because uh, St. Jude is a community hospital. 
It doesn't matter if you're in New York, California, Puerto Rico, London, England. It's a community hospital and this organization is a community organization. So um, her ability to touch families and share the message of St. Jude is very special right. within the community. Sounds good. Now, Terrence, let people know, um, you know, anything that you may want them to know about St. Jude's and also how they can maybe get involved. Awesome. So what you can do right now is go to stjude.org. That's S-T-J-U-D-E dot O-R-G slash walk run. In September, we have a huge walk in over 60 locations where you can walk virtually or physically get out and support the organization. So go to stjude.org slash walk run, put in your zip code or your city name, and it'll give you the closest location. Register yourself, your friends, have a party and celebrate defeating cancer in our lifetime. Sounds good. Everybody, this is your boy Terrence, representative at St. Jude's Hospital. Definitely make sure you get involved. Children overcoming obstacles, so many obstacles in life. So definitely it's very serious. Let's just make sure that we are very involved and definitely join, join his team. Join He's going to create a team. <laughs> join his team. Be the biggest, the best team around and keep loving what he said. We'll be back. <laughs>